Steve, this is another Dracaena. Tell me about, uh, about this one. We call it a Reflexa. Reflexa? It's a Dracaena Reflexa, uh, sometimes known by its old genus, Pleomaly. Okay. But uh, the genius scientists are telling us now it's a uh, Dracaena Reflexa. So um, it's a beautiful plant, lots of characters, lots of leaves, deep green leaves. Um, again, a Dracaena, so it can handle a little bit lower light. This guy, it's on the higher light end of the Dracaena uh, family. So medium to higher light yeah. will do better? Yeah, it'll do better. And you can stick this thing in, in, a, <clears throat> in a, an area where you need this kind of well, depth and Well, you can height. see this one has grown in a standard form. Mm -hmm. um, we can't get them in a bush form where it's foliage all the way down to the bottom, but this is a standard form. Um, so you can see the character of the trunk and uh, it will go, as you can see, uh, six and a half, seven feet in a beautiful presentation. And this is another one of those Florida fresh type uh, coming this from is, Florida? Uh, this is, uh, comes to us from a excellent grower in South Florida mm -hmm. and uh, they have great techniques and this is a very, very strong plant. What about the water on this? A little more, a little less? Again, on the Dracaenas, less is better. Less is best. Less, less is best. All right, so we don't, want it to, we don't want a lot of water because it'll rot the roots. And of course, you've got a nice light uh, soil. I can sure. tell it's nice and light and friable, mm -hmm. so air and water it should go right through it. Yes, so um, check it, um, let it dry down, uh, let it go past moist, and then wet it thoroughly, and then uh, let it go for three or four weeks, and you should be good to go. And they're gonna, I would think, hardly have to prune it? Uh, no, as you can see, uh, it's been pruned in several places here. To make it bush. In here, and it's shot out new growth. So if you have this next to a, east, west, or south window mm -hmm. in good light. Again, this is another one you're gonna to wanna to turn occasionally. Right. Um, but if you go ahead and cut the stem, it'll throw out new growth for you. You said a quarter turn normally? Quarter turn every time you check it for water and it'll be happy. And, and it'll be a good one. Yes. Well, I love the, the color, I love the fullness to this plant. It, it does make a very nice presentation. And uh, again, you can throw a little light up on the wall, it makes a nice silhouette. Um, this guy, uh, this is just one of my favorites, Stan. I love I can, this plant. I can see that people get this from plants are going to be happy campers. Yes, and to keep this baby clean, again, because it's got so many leaves, um, again, it might, uh, a good kind little, of missed it. little missed it with a little soap and water, and then uh, give it a wipe down, and you'll be uh, clean for days. Did I get you? No. Okay. If you did, you can clean me up, fella. Okay. Looks like this is going to be a nice uh, so, yeah, this, shiny leaf. Yeah, but you can, you know, you can get multiple leaves at one time take any dirt off and keep it nice and clean and you see how nice and shiny it is. Outstanding <clears throat> choice. This is a great choice. It's underrated, but I love this plant. Well, not after today. Not after today. Right. Dracaena Reflexa.